This was your last home game in charge. How do you reflect on your spell in charge up to this point? Well, in the end, I'm not happy with with the, the results, especially in the last uh, five, four or five weeks. I think um, until the West Ham game, we were still in the race in, in, in three competitions. Uh, we would have had the chance to proceed in the Champions League. But I think the first setback was the, the loss in the Cup uh, on penalties against Middlesbrough and uh, that we lost against uh, Atletico in the Champions League. Yes, that was also a setback. But um, I think we had good moments, as I said, until West, the West Ham game. Uh, we were in the race in, in, in three competitions. We conceded less goals, but um, in the last couple of weeks, uh, the performances were not as good as they should have been. Um, today, and at times also against Chelsea now, we were better. But in, in general, we just uh, lack consistency. When you look at a night like tonight, does that only add to your frustration? Sorry? When you look at your performance on a night like tonight and the second half, perhaps, against Chelsea. Yeah, I mean, as I said, we showed some good performances uh, um, before and after Christmas. Uh, if I think about the, on, on the game against Leeds away, uh, Tottenham, West Ham at home. So we had Aston Villa away. Uh, we had good, good games, but uh, not consist not, we were not consistent, consistent enough. Shortly, your role will be to help the new management rebuild here. How quickly does that process need to begin? Has it begun already? Well, so far, we haven't been able to speak. I mean, Eric's focus is on now winning the, uh, the, 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 the Dutch league. We had our focus on our games here. But, um, yeah, I think it's obvious because quite a few players will leave the club. So there will be the need for new players, uh, for top quality players. And I uh, strongly believe that uh, if everybody works together on this, on this process, that uh, we can raise the level and bring back Manchester United into spaces and areas where they should be. What do you feel in your position will be the priorities in terms of positions? I mean, apart from goalkeeping, where we have uh, three excellent, if not four, but definitely three excellent goalkeepers with Tom Heaton, with uh, David De Gea and Dean Henderson, in all the other areas, I think uh, there will be players leaving the club and um, therefore I wouldn't uh, put my focus on, 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 on special areas on the pitch. I think it should go all through the team. Just finally, rebuilding United is obviously a long-term project. In your view, how long is it likely to be before you feel this club can really challenge for the top again? As I said, other clubs uh, only needed two or three transfer windows, but um, then again, you have to make sure that uh, from, from day one, from now on, we bring in top quality players who really help, uh, help us to raise the level and help all the other teams, I mean, all the other players in the team. And um, yeah, if this happens in this summer and then in the winter again and in the next summer window, uh, I don't think it should take too long.